It is set for one fall, and your referee is Sean P. Introducing first, making his return to Adam and Mid South, weighing in at 220 pounds from Waterloo, Iowa, the Savage Weight Fred Yeha. His opponent, weighing in at 300 pounds from Georgetown, Kentucky. He is a former three-time IWA World Champion, the 2019 Ted Petty Invitational winner, Impact Wrestling Superstar, the best hand in the house, legendary Larry D. Here we go, be semi-main event here at You Ain't Seen Crazy at a match I've been looking for, forward to since it was announced, and I didn't even know I wanted it. Legendary Larry D against the savage weight, Fred Yehi, making his return here tonight. You know, and the problem with both of these wrestlers is that you oh, oh, cannot, you can study tape on them. Right. It's not going to do you any good. Yep, they're going to switch it up. Yes, exactly. They're going to have a different. Larry's, Larry's a, what, 18-plus year veteran? Right. And... Yeha is one of the most unorthodox wrestlers going today. Former Evolve Tag Team Champion, former FIP World Champion. Yes. Obviously, we don't need to go down the accolades of, of Larry D. We just did. Yeah. Of legendary Larry D. We can though. 2019 yeah. TPI winner. Look at this. Three time get out of Mid South champion. Oh. oh. Fred Yeha, known for those stomps. Oh yeah. To the downed opponent. Too, yeah. Last time Fred Yehi was here, too, I remember him. There was a strict no video policy going on out of Bay Mid-South at the time. And someone did a shooting star press off. Back yes, Brayden Lee taking a, yes. doing a shooting star press off of the. In a scramble match. Yes. And he lost Fred, his mind. He, yeah, he lost his mind. He shot it and put it on Facebook. We've thankfully. And everything uh, exploded. Yeah, where we've Fred Yehi yeah, we, lost his damn mind. He couldn't believe We've it. thankfully uh, softened, softened the no video policy here in IWM itself since then. Oh, yeah. Just don't be a jerk about things. Right. Yeah. We don't want you. We don't want you Facebook living whole shows. Yeah. Or Big chop no, there from Larry D. That's right. Larry D in the best shape of his IWA career, transitioning back to the trunks, looking like a million fucking bucks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this guy. Last time we saw Fred Yeha, I believe he beat Shane Mercer in a TPI, the 2019 TPI. 2019, yep. And then kicked him in the balls as uh, as he left the ring. See how he squatted that bottom rope right. to kind of get the upwards angle yep. on him? He did it again. Because if he comes straight at Larry right, D, right. it's not going to work. But watch. There you go. Straight at him. Ducks the line coming off the ropes. Exactly. Big shoulder See, block it's not there. Work coming straight at Larry. Larry's too powerful. He's too strong. I mean, that's 300 pounds of, of bull muscle right, right there. You know what I'm saying? Just straight up hoss. And Hooking him here. End of the corner they go. The crazy thing is the savage. Oh look at this! Weight, look at this! Yes, the savage weight is not a joke. Here's the hardest part here is is him being able. To, see, he's still able to move with Larry on top of him. Right, Lots right, of people right. Can't even do that. Sean's asking him. Larry's making him wear all 300 pounds of that weight right. too, on his collarbone, which only takes eight pounds of pressure to break one. By the way. Back to a vertical base. Switching up the headlock. It gets Larry back in the corner. See, he's got, holding the rope behind his back there, and the ref doesn't see that. He sees it now, but before that, he didn't see his hand. Shoulder to the midsection. That, yeah, that Yeehaw was holding the belt, holding the ropes. See that sweat fly? Reminds you of the old boxing gloves in Madison Square Garden. You see Big elbow. Each other. Hell, remind you of there's Bruno another Martino one. In Madison Square Garden. Right. See that sweat fly under the lights. In so the that heat. mirrors him over. There's a stomp. Oh, there's one of those stomps we were talking about. Right to the sternum. From the savage weight. Glad to have him back in IWA Mid South. Oh. Absolutely. Look at this. Like I said, one of the, the most unorthodox 
and awkward, and I'm not trying. This is not. It's not meant to be a uh, um, a slight. No, if yes. anything, it's a. It's definitely a compliment. Right. There's a, there's guy wrestlers that are like that that are just so damn. Right. Awkward. Jason Kincaid, another one yes. that is unorthodox. Will pull out something you've never seen before. Freddie Aha, very comparable. Yes. Big double axe to the back of the neck. Freddie Ahai. You said it best too. Oh. oh, taking the chop there. Yeah, but as soon as it hit his chest, what happened? He was down. He may be the savage weight, but Larry, like I said, that's 300 pounds of what used to be almost four. You know, what right? I'm and he's transitioned that into. A, yeah, I had him at 330 on my uh, on my intro list for for years and years, and it, maybe it was closer to 350, maybe it was closer to 345, but. A legit 300 pounds, like I said, best shape of his IWA career here tonight. Oh, yeah. Going to slam him out of the corner. Uh-oh. It's the it's ropes. Big running soccer kick. Go for that cover. Puts all the weight on him again. You see, before he even tucked the leg, though, the savage weight's already started kicking. He's already started trying to get that right. momentum back so they can kick out like of he said, wearing... The 300 pounds of legendary Larry D. And I got to say it. I mean, it gets it, people probably like, oh, you say that all the time. But this is a semi-main event tonight. And right now, it's like standing room only over by the locker right, room. Right, absolutely. The door. Like half the locker room's out watching this match. Five minutes gone in this match. Five minutes gone. Five minutes gone. Because they know at any given time, Larry D can step up. They don't want to have to peek out a a curtain and miss something they want to be out here watching it we got we got people that was in match one all the way to the out world champion over there oh, showing yeah. the respect to legendary larry d former out world champion himself and world travel superstar fred yehi yes we're gonna get a clean break here i don't think so no i don't think you will either. hey they're trying they're trying hey, oh, oh there we go form shots here from yehi big Wait, chop to the chest oh, oh that's what he's got to do though oh hip attack look at that He's got to do that. He's got to make it dirty. He's got to make it a scrap, you know. And Larry's ready for that, too. I mean, he came in as one of Todd Morton's Texas hangmen. We talk right, about it all right. the time. He came in as a scrap. The only man. one left. The only one left. Yeah. Stan Sierra, first one out the door. Derek Neal here and there. Now they've been South Legendary. Larry D has been here oh, since. When they had the masks going, it was so funny because back then, the back row heckers was a whole bunch of us. And people were going, oh, it's B.J. Whitmer. And I was like, no, I don't think it's B.J. Whitmer. Right. Big back fist there from Larry. As a lot of people thought Derek Neal, they, they thought that it, that's who it was, but not a lot of people knew who Larry D was at the time. Oh, look at this! He's in. He's out of the the ropes and he's choking him using the top rope. Yes. Sean getting loud. Yeah, get mad, Sean. Get real pissed about it. Yeah, because you're not going to do nothing with either one of these guys. He's going for a cravat, but Larry able to cut him off. Well, I no, think it's it, also because, yeah. he, don't get me wrong, the savage weight is the thing. Look at him whipping that 300 pounds over. He's got the. See, but he can't get those legs completely locked right, like right, he right. wants. He's got ankle to ankle, but he really wants ankle to knee. You know? But he's got a lock on it. Look, he's, he's got to watch up. out, though. Larry's got some limbs loose that it can do some damage. Oh, yeah. And look at Larry. I mean, look at look at the. It's taken almost every bit of his. Fred Yehi, Leg span. Another, Fred Yehi, another guy that we've seen barefoot here in Ida Bay and South before. Oh yeah. Transitioning back to the to the smaller boots. But look at this, oh, yeah. look at this, the Koji clutch, his finishing hold, but oh. there. Mm -hmm. And you know Yehi's gonna use all of his county can. Yes. He's off he's off the hold. Oh, he's oh. on his hand. That's a jerk move you ever saw. Oh, he's going after the ear too. That's trying to I control said, the man with his ear. Yeah, you can't. You're not going to be able to watch this. Look at this. Look. Oh! oh that's an old. You know what first time I ever saw that? Old Guerrero. Not Chavo, not Eddie, their father. Uh, Hector. I'm sorry. Hector Guerrero. Their uncle. Uncle Uncle Hector. I was going for a waist lock. In Memphis. Right, right. That was the first time I ever seen that move done. Oh, oh Larry Martin. drives him. Into Shocked me as a little kid. I was like, oh my gosh, he's kicking him like a bicycle. Goes back to the waist yeah, lock, does he? It's taking it's taking the toll on Larry too. Oh, Larry crushes him in the corner, but all he did was break the grip. Larry's gotta mount some offense here, man. Oh, see there we go. Oh, oh. back chomp. A lot of a lot of uh, pro wrestlers look at that as a disrespectful move. Oh yeah. 
So, you know, Larry's not too happy about that one. No. Trying to get the elbows off. Oh, that one landed flush. That first one was kind of a little bit out of the way, but that last one, that's, oh. Man. Elbow to the he base of the neck. one there. Oh, he's, he had to oh. put his, he's had to put his hands there to cover him up. You see him? Oh. Oh, knee. And keeping hold of him so he can't fall, so he can do more damage to oh, him. Oh, dude, just taking a savage weight, just beating him down to the mat. Oh, diving knee trembler there from the best hand in the house. Tell you what, though, it's been a little bit since I've seen somebody take the, take it to Larry D right. like this guy has, you know? Yeah, I feel him worse for wear here, but Larry D not doing too hot himself. He's trying to get back to a vertical base. Yeah, he's been pretty much dominating out of being Mid-South, you know, for the... 5'9", badass Fred Yehi, back up. Larry D coming in, big oh. lifter in the corner. Oh, he's got that weight lock. Is he going to get him up? Oh, my oh, God! What a German it's suplex! Koji clutch! Oh, he he's can't not... get his lock, though. He can't get his hands locked. He cannot get that other hand underneath there locked. I can see from here. Oh, he, he barely got the fingertips. Yeah. He barely got the fingertips. He's got him. Yeah, he does have him locked now. Oh, oh but Larry's going to roll over on him. Oh, and uh, head scissors. Ten minutes gone in this match. Ten minutes gone. Ten minutes gone. Oh, uh, now he's dropping those hard elbow, those forearm shots in Larry's gut. Taking the breath out of Larry D. Savage wins. Feeling it too, though, man. Fans clapping for Larry. Big chop to the chest there. Oh, you see the sweat flying. Oh, yeah. Hits the ropes. Oh, he runs through that one. Coming off the ropes. Rolling clothesline. Takes him down. Ran right through him. Ran right through him with that. He's calling for that best hand in the house. Are we going to see it? Winds up. Oh, he grabs the goozle. Back fist. Going for another German. Standing switch. I was going to roll him up. Oh, he can't get the shoulders down. Oh, oh almost a three that, on That might have cost him right there, B. Not getting the shoulders immediately down due to the size of Larry D. Might have cost him. There's oh. a big elbow to the head. Right to the ear, too. Pop up. Knee strike. Catches him. What's it's ropes. Oh, low bridge. Larry goes flying. Oh, hits the floor hard. We didn't see the landing, but we heard it yeah. all the way over here. Yeah, he hit the floor real hard over there. Traditional that. rules on this. 20 count on the floor. Fred might get a count out victory if he plays his cards right. I think he'll take it, too. Yeah, this Fred Yeh high. Yeah, he'll take it. I would. I ain't gonna lie. W's W. Pay windows. Pay windows. Referee Sean making the count. He's going to tell him, count him, count him. But does Fred Yeha remember that it's a 20 count on the floor here in IWM itself? Uh, a, lot of, a, a, a lot of wrestlers. He does now. Yeah, he knows now. Uh-oh, Larry got up, and he's back down due to the damage done. I wish somebody whispered to Fred it's 100 count on the floor just to mess with him. Up to 16 now. Uh -oh. Can the best hand in the house get back up? Man, he's only got three. I see some fingertips. Up to 18 here. Are we going to get a count out? Up to 19. In before the 20. His teeth, boy. Just barely. Oh, and there's those hip attacks. The almost like a single leg drop there from Yehi. Tosses him back in. Oh, oh, oh boy! Like a clap of thunder from over here. Rolls, Rolls through. through. Fast hand in the house. 
Oh, oh, he's on Dream Street. Oh, he's out. Do you see how starched he was when his neck hit that back of the ropes? Yeah, he yeah, might have got whiplash out. on that bottom rope. Yeah, he was out. I, he was out before he hit the ground. Larry's got to get him, though, and cover him. That's not – the referee didn't declare a knockout. Got to get him out of the ropes. He's got to get him out of the ropes here, B. It's like pulling dead weight. He's calling for another best hand in the house. I don't know if Yehi can can I don't know if he's gonna make it up. Can survive it. He was able to hang on that bottom rope. Just he was barely able. That's a world of difference than eating another one of these. Oh, he's playing possum! Goozle! Nobody home for the back fist! Headbutt on the money! Uh oh. Hits a bottom no, he rope. almost oh, goes out. He, out. he almost goes out of the ring, yeah. There's that curb stomp. Oh, we caught him in the powerbomb positioning. Sit out, powerbomb. Oh, he's got like a triangle. Uh oh, he's got he's got the arm in position. Let's see though, he may have him. Oh, he's pounding away. The ref may call this. Larry may be out. The ref may call this. Oh, no. Larry's trying to get it back to a vertical pace. Got to watch though. the shoulders on the mat. He's got the shoulder up. Uh -oh. But Larry. Fading, though. Yeah. Fading oh, he's fading. Down he's, he's back down. He he's back be. down here. He's out. He's going to transition into that Koji clutch right here. Middle of the ring. Oh, and he's got. Oh, he's, he's hammer fisting him, too. Yeah, that, he's out. He's Fred. out. Wow. Fred Yeeha comes in. The winner of the match by With a huge the win. Savage Wade, Fred Yeeha. What a semi main event that one was from these two men.